the 45 points, we are back in business. <laughs> and you can take that to the bank. Completely <laughs> carbon neutral. What the fuck? What's going on, y'all? Jimmy Macrum. It's time for episode 11 of season 6 of The Office. Season, season, episode 10 was blocked in America and I think Canada. I don't understand what's going on with this season. We have been copyright free for uh, season 2, 3, 4, most of 5, well, most of 3, 4, 5. And now they block everything left and right. They're not playing. Fucking Kim and Matumbo over here. What is going on? Oh, well. Keep pushing along. For those of you who missed an episode, you go to patreon.com backslash Jimmy Macrum. You find the episode the office you're looking for. If it's been blocked, it will be free over there. Because I care. Because we're good people. Don't forget to press the like button for the algorithm. And subscribe so you don't miss the episode. Let's get to it. Recyclops will have his revenge! I think this was also the year that he renounced Earth Day and vowed to destroy the planet he once loved. Oh my god, you guys, look! It's Recyclops! Recyclops destroy! Oh, poor Aaron. <laughs> I thought you were killed by Paludicorn. Ah, uh, Paludicorn wishes! Ah, I love how fucking Stanley remembers all the... And I just do a little bit of a nod, sort of a humble thing. Sure. Nope, then my face is down, they can't see my face. And it looks like you're taking a dump. Alan Brand what? is the CEO of the company, if title is important to you, has <laughs> personally invited moi. Don't do the twirl. Lose the twirl. The twirl sucks. Michael, I hated the twirl. Jesus. Hate the twirl! Okay, he obviously I'm not twirl. going to do the twirl. He's definitely going to do it. It's not even a twirl, it's a spin. I might do the spin. <laughs> the long-term problem is batting. The short-term problem is the company has no cash and there's nowhere to get it. Okay, Oscar, I don't need the whole enchilada, just bullet points. Those are the bullet points. <laughs> <laughs> and in this case, I think we are celebrating me. Jesus. A whole bunch of chubby. Oh, a bunch of boobs. Hate to break it to you, Oscar, but some of us like boobs. Calves. <laughs> Calves all the way. I'm so jealous, right? Car seats eight. The limo seats eight. Okay. Then Jim and Pam and Ryan plus a guest. No, no. thanks. I'll use it when you're done. Wow. That's bigger than my bed. Work. Get, get, get. Who's playing with the button? You poor bastard. Probably going under. Could though. go either way. Seems like it's leaning one way. Maybe we should just wait and find out. Definitely. Okay. So should we wait to find out before we start doing all this stuff? Nah. Might as well do it now. Ryan is the worst. Mr. Scott? Yes. I'm Lori. Oh, hi. Thank you for joining us. Come with me. Well, thank you. And, and please call, continue to call me Mr. Scott. <laughs> Officers. God, this is serious. Seated, we have the former Congressman Chris O'Keefe. Ah, God. your eminence. <laughs> I'm not mad at the bow. Excuse me. Motherfucker. Ah, damn it. Twice. What are we doing? Look, do you want to be able to tell your grandkids you stood up for yourself during the America's biggest financial crisis? How is he going to have grandkids? I had the same thought. He could adopt. Oh, shit! <laughs> Absolutely. And we are poised to come through this more streamlined and profitable streamlined. than ever. That's suit talk. Uh, so streamlined, getting rid of motherfuckers. We're going bankrupt, you think? <laughs> they are really angry. The shareholders need to empower our leaders. Michael Scott. Oh, Brenton, Brent shit. Manager. Another bright spot in the Dunder Mifflin landscape. Our new waste pulp repurposing plant in Milford. Way bigger pop, yeah. I think Michael doesn't really care about these things. I care about him, and I'm just as much of a boss as Michael. <laughs> they snicker at him? And I can do anything that Michael can do, all right? 
Who here believes that I have as much power as Michael? Fire somebody, Jim. Make a point. They invited me to their hospitality suite where Don't. I had free food and it oh was delicious. Oh my God. Get this. Know how nice they are? Limo. I want to hear your question. Clearly. I love seeing suits get to do. I just do. I gotta make an example out of him. You do. Should I just fire him? Can yes. Actually, well, I can't really imagine you yelling at anyone. Why? Well, Happen. We'll be back with some answers. I okay. I know that you're fuck? mad. At Let's go, sir. Oh my we god. We're gonna we're gonna go out there during this break, and we're gonna come back with a plan. Okay. We're gonna come back with a plan for you. It's a 45 day plan. <laughs> 45 days. We get to 45 points. We're back in business. And you can take that to the bank. Completely <laughs> carbon neutral. What the fuck? <laughs> I love you, New York. Oh. <laughs> awesome. Well, the boss is gonna get upset? Have people more angry at him? 45 day thing, we go with that. Day 45, company saved. Day 44, go. What do we got? We have 15 minutes. Excuse me? <laughs> this Mexican guy, he is a math whiz. He knows economics as well as he knows bullfighting, and I am going to... That's wild. Oscar, why don't you come over here? Let me present you. Step up, step up there. Oh Oscar my God. Out of this murky, murky situation. Take That's away. wild. Oh, you set my man up for failure. Your new office. How what? Great. Um, I'm very sorry. You're a good kid. You know when it gets bigger once you're in there. Enjoy it. <laughs> Go ahead, Jim. Absolutely. <laughs> As does Mr. Scott, that we are in the best of hands, uh, capable hands. Oh. Saying to me. Oh. I know you want to keep your job. Oh, Oscar. I'm so disappointed. That was a waste of a text. <laughs> I think we might be in trouble. He's our best manager. Where's the off button on this moron? Oh. I have personally won over 17 Dundee Awards, so I am not a moron. And I'm just trying to help, you know? So, you're the moron. Oh, shit! Go ahead, Michael! He can take the boss. He's had his limo ride. Yeah, fair enough. Limos are for people who make the company money, not lose millions and have no plan. There he is, there he is. So oh, we're trying to... <laughs> After all, we're the only ones with anything to celebrate. <laughs> if this line is any indication of how this company is being run, then we are in big trouble. What about ropes along the lines that you can hold on to? Thank you for your suggestions. Yes. Oh, boy. All right. That was The Office, episode 11 of season 6. Where to begin? Great episode. Great? I go great. One of the best episodes of the season so far. As far as I'm concerned, I enjoyed every thread we had here. Michael, that's not true. Oscar's finish felt a little balls with me. But um, that's not because I had hope. And you shouldn't. Oscar already told you what the fuck was down, going down. I'm not risking my job. Which fits his character. Um, but Michael, great, obviously. Jim, it's the most I like Jim in forever. You put anybody against Ryan, I am a fan. Nice to see Ryan get some type of comeuppance. He's so awful. Um, and it was, I won't say equally as nice, but rather pleasant to see Phyllis catch it. It's not a stray, but she caught a whiff after her. What's the one I'm looking for? <laughs> I don't want to say, I don't want to say impudence. Because then I sound like that fucking senator, but you know what I mean. 
Um, oh, what was great? That was great. I can't believe how cathartic that all was. I mean, I know I hate suits in general, but I didn't realize I built up so much frustration with the um, Dunder Mifflin crew. Because to see them get booed, even though Michael was in the middle, was great. Then they're in this room. Michael's the only one actually trying to do something. The rest of them seem, I don't know, like they're giving up. They're going to get their fucking tax write-offs and move on with life. Had the nerve to call him a moron. Now, to be fair to him, to be fair to the senator, former senator, that is, Michael's a moron. Let's just be clear. But he's the only one trying. And you're the ones who fucking ran his business to the ground. How dare you? How dare you call him a moron? You're, you're the wrong messenger, sir, even if the message is right. <laughs> because I'm going out there and coming out with a 45-day plan. <laughs> 45 points. <laughs> and then starts running the stage. You knew. You knew once the rea first reaction happened that this can only go sideways. And Michael's going to say whatever he has to say to get people to like him in the moment. Awesome. Sorry, awesome. Where does this go? This is like a whole story beat now. A story thread, rather. Where it's played out over several episodes so far. I assume they're not going to go bankrupt. We have how many more seasons to go? I assume we'll be all right. I don't know how. Anyway, uh, post your comments down below. Like, share, subscribe. 